Hello everyone, welcome back to Science Gully. How are you all? Hope you all are fine. And during these days, especially during this pandemic, it's very important to stay healthy. I'm sure many of you might be keeping track of your health by checking your blood pressure, sugar level, oxygen level, etc. Nowadays, in market, there are many smart devices available to keep track of your health. Some of them are wearable. So what we're going to do today is pretty much related to it. We are going to design a circuit to measure heartbeat rate or pulse rate. I'm sure designing this circuit will be really fun. So without any further ado, let's start. The most important component to design today's circuit is pulse sensor. This is how it looks like. Before moving on to the working of the sensor, let's understand some basic concepts. What is a heartbeat? A person's heartbeat is the sound of their walls in his or her heart contracting or expanding as they force blood from one region to another. The number of times the heart beats per minute is the heartbeat rate or pulse rate. The beat of the heart can be felt in any artery close to the skin, which is the pulse. I'm sure you would have measured the pulse rate manually by using your index finger and your middle finger and placing them on your wrist and adjusting the pressure. Now let us move on to the working of the pulse sensor. This sensor has two parts. One end has a circular portion which you have to clip on to your fingertip or earlobe and the second end has jumper wires which plug into the Arduino. If you can see, there is a LED on the front side of the sensor. We have to place either the fingertip or yellow on the LED. It should be placed directly on the top of it. Let's consider we are placing the fingertip on the LED. The light emitted from the LED will fall on the fingertip. Some of the light will get absorbed by the blood and some will reflect. The reflected light will be detected by the light detector, which is present on the circular board. The amount of light absorbed depends on the blood volume of that particular tissue. The detector output is in the form of electrical signal and it is proportional to the heartbeat rate. This minor change in received light is analyzed over time to determine our heartbeat. Let's move on to the pinout. Here there are only three pins ground, VCC and output signal S. Ground and VCC are for power connections and output signal is from where we get the output. So let's do the connections. This is the schematic that we are going to follow for the connections. The materials required are pulse rate sensor, Arduino Uno board and LED. So first connect the ground pin of the sensor to ground pin of the Arduino. Then connect pin VCC of the sensor to pin 5 volt on Arduino. Then connect the signal pin of the sensor to pin A0 of Arduino. Then connect anode of the LED to pin number 13 on Arduino and cathode of the LED to pin ground of Arduino. And we are done with the connections. Now let us move on to the program part. This program is readily available. All that you have to do is go to manage libraries and search for pulse sensor playground library and install it. If you don't find it in your library section, go download it from GitHub. I have put the link in the description box. Once you download it from there, go to Documents. In your Arduino folder in Libraries, you have to save it there. Go to Files, Examples, Pulse Sensor Playground and click on Getting Started Project. This program reads the pulse sensor's value and plots it to the serial plotter. Now let's upload the program. It is very important to hold the sensor properly. Let me show how to do, how to do it. 
Don't apply too much pressure or too less pressure. Now let's try the other program to measure BPM beats per minute. This program prints the BPM number of beats per minute to the serial monitor. In this program, when the heartbeat is detected, the LED blinks. Now let's see the beats per minute output on the serial monitor. This is how you can design your own circuit to keep track of your health and measure pulse rate. So stay healthy, stay fit. See you in the next session. Till then, bye-bye.